And in blah, blah, blah. Conclusion of blah, blah, blah. Yo, I don't know what you've been told, but the history of our nation is worth more than gold. So stop right there and take a seat. I'm gonna serve you a lesson. Get ready for the heat. The English started spreading like what up? This is the fur trade. We want the Appalachian Mountains to the valley. The French don't like it. It was already there. So they fought for seven years like wolves and bears. The French didn't anymore was not very fun. But in the end, it was the English who fought and won. Then the king started talking like I'm taking your rights. And that's what started a whole new fight. There was a massacre in Boston, the boycotts on the street. The stamp out came about, but we were playing for keeps. All of these things really shook our nation. Oh, and don't forget about the random taxation. Some dudes threw a party with some tea. The intolerable accident soon came to be. We fought in Lexington, Concord, and Bunker Hill. We fought for our ground, now this is getting real. Give me liberty or death, says Patrick Henry. Payne wrote common sense about defending. The lawyers were loyal to only the king. The patriots were like, we want to be free. Rivera rode on a horse all through the night. Warning columnists of records who were looking to fight. Motivated by grief, Congress to declare. Independence from Great Britain was in the air. George was the general of the military. He fought for freedom and liberty. He had victories at Boston and Saratoga too. Then France became our friends. Man, that was something new. Valley Forge was cold and the conditions were tough, but the defeat of Cornwallis was some cool stuff. This is how I learned. Me, Mackenzie Clayton, we all learn different ways, so don't be hate. If we just stick to what works best, we know we're gonna ace the test. Word. All right, class, are you ready? Mackenzie Clayton! Oh, I'm awake, I'm awake. It's test taking time. Take one and pass it down. <laughs>